Okay, so here we have a 2011 uh, Gibson Custom Shop Les Paul Axis Standard with the, uh, it's the stop tail version, which is really, really cool. You don't see this one quite as often. I gave this one an eight out of 10. It just got some scratches, some dings, and a small amount of wear on the back. Uh, as far as some of the specs on this one, the weight is six pounds, 12 ounces, so super light for a Les Paul. Uh, it's got what Gibson is calling a slim C-shaped neck with a contoured axis heel. Uh, the pickups on this one, it's got a 498T in the bridge and a 496R in the neck. Uh, we do have our push-pull pots right here for coil tapping those, they're for conductor. Um, rosewood fingerboard on this one. And then, um, yeah, most noticeably, check that out. It's got your contours on there, really like that. Uh, let's get in there and check out the condition on this one. So for the top looks really good on this one. I think the finish on this one might be, this looks like iced tea. This would definitely be the one if you're looking for a really light uh, Les Paul. Six pounds, 12 ounces. That's almost Billy Gibbons light. Okay, Rosewood Fingerboard looks good on this one. And the frets are great, there is no wear. Uh, front of the headset looks really good. We just have some light scratches. Let's go ahead and flip that one over. Uh, serial number CS103087. There's our Gibson uh, Cluson cell tuners. Their Gibson Custom Shop logo on the back of the headstock. Nice clean headstock, no cracks, breaks, or repairs. And the back of the neck looks good as well. The back of the guitar, uh, a little bit of wear on the back. You can kind of see it down in that area. Some more. This is where the majority of the wear is on this guitar is in this area. I'll go over it really slowly. Okay, let's go ahead and flip this one over. So there we have it on that one, 2011 Gibson Custom Shop, Les Paul, uh, standard access in the stop tail.